Hey guys, this is Kurshevat Singh from Melbourne Institute of Technology, Melbourne campus. Today I am here to share my project with you all guys. My project is called Automatic Irrigation System. As the name says, automatic, which means there is no more manual work. So everything will be automatically done with the help of the Bluetooth module which I have connected on my device. So basically, my project is based on the Arduino UNO box, the Bluetooth device, soil moisture, and the water pump, which I have connected all together with the help of the Arduino UNO box. So let's see how it works. First of all, we have to connect our mobile device with the Bluetooth module. First of all, let's connect that. As you can see, it's connected now. So then after that, we have to send something, some command, anything, which means, which will be illegal. So now it, it gave us two, four options. Number one is the soil moisture sensor, which means if we press one, it will send us the soil moisture value. Number two is the automatic mode, which means it will turn on the pump when the soil is dry and turn off the pump when the soil is wet. Number three and number four are for the turn on or turn off the pump manually if we want to. So first of all, let's test the soil moisture. First of all, I would like to show you, I have taken two soils. One is dry soil, the other one is the wet soil. So let's run the soil moisture into the wet soil first. So number one, as we can see, it's giving us the value around three to four hundred. So the number one is completed. Now we will put the soil moisture sensor into the dry soil. So before that, we have to clean the moisture such that it will give us the real values. Now we put that in the dry soil. So now we will run the number one command again. As we can see, it's giving us the value above 900, which means the soil moisture is working perfectly fine. So now we will go to the command number two, which is the automatic mode. So first of all, I would like to show you with the wet soil. As it's wet soil, according to the project, it should not turn on the motor according to the enough moisture already present in the soil. So we have now press 2. As the moisture is 388 and the pump is not on. which means it's working perfect for the wet soil. Now I would like to run the same command for the dry soil. So before that, I will wipe the sensor off such that there will be no moisture left from the wet soil. We put into the dry soil. So now we run the automatic command for the dry soil. Also need to put the water outlet there. So according to me, it should turn on as the soil is dry. So let's press two. And the water is pump is on and automatically turn off because there's already enough water into the soil. So as we have seen, the pump automatically turns off when the water goes into the soil and enough moisture is gained. So now we will run the number three and number four command. Number three is to turn on the pump. So when we press three, the pump goes on. As for number three, the water pump goes on and the number four is to turn off the pump. Let's run command number four. We send number four and the pump goes off. 
which shows that the all the four commands are working perfectly fine and our project is going good so that's all my project hopefully you guys like it and thank you for listening to me and if you have any question please don't hesitate to ask me thank you have a good day